you believe. You don't know I can uh, how are you? I'm Lowell on the fifth foodie. I'm your over 40. <laughs> oh, in this life, can't change up. My team too real, so we stay young. Yeah, this is our year, can't change up. My team too real, so we stay young. Yeah, this is our year, can't change up. My team too real. Now I'm just messing with you. Hey, how are you? I'm Lowell on the fifth foodie. I am your over 40 lifestyle transformation fitness guru. How are you? It's the weather, the fish booty. I hope you're having a great day and feeling good for yourself because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. Today is about mental health and loving yourself. But what I'm going to do is show you how to love yourself in any situation, just like I'm doing. And this is how I'm surviving this crazy world and making a path for myself and other big opportunities. Hey, before we do that and have that conversation, I need you to please subscribe to my channel. I need you to tell somebody. I need one person to tell another person and one other person to tell 10 or more other people. I need you to go on and make sure this happens. Why? Because I want to spread the word of love, positivity, and self-worth. Because at the end of the day, I don't think we have enough of that in the world. I mean, everybody want to be Arnold Schwarzenegger or super buff and all that or super sexy and get BBLs and everything cut off. And that's cool. But guess what? Why? Love yourself. And do the stuff that's free to make yourself better. So subscribe to my channel. Tell a friend. Please let everyone know that if you want to feel better, join Luella the Fit Foodie, the LLTFF community. I am your lifestyle transformation guru. I'm going to show you how to get better using lifestyle tips, tricks, and how to feel good and get yourself yoked and get sweat. And feel good about what's in your body because at the end of the day, what else you got? If you don't have a good body, you ain't got shit in life. So let's talk about mental health. So mental health. Ooh, that's a tough one. I'm going to tell you straight up, as a black man, mental health in my community is so tough. I mean, I grew up in the ghetto, in the hood. People get shot, robbed, killed, and that was on Tuesday. I ain't going to tell you about Wednesday. I'm not going to tell you about the drug deals on Thursday. I'm not going to tell you about the side shows on Friday. I'm damn sure I'm not going to tell you about the hangouts on Saturday. Lord, Sunday church was well. Some place I didn't get to go to because the bullets dodged and trying to get there with cool. And my mom was more spiritual anyway. My parents was divorced. So that's a whole another subject. But mentally, you can see, I had to go through a lot of trauma. Like, all the things I just told you were no joke. And that was real. From East Oakland, California. Look it up. I'm going to tell you, baby, it ain't no joke out there back when I was growing up. So, how do I get from that place of living in almost war zones? Living in places where people were dying and rats and roaches and fear to here? A place where I'm here willing to give you my soul, my heart, my love to make sure you're inspired to feel better about yourself and find a better path to your tomorrow. Well, all started with mental health. And I had to go through some, through some struggles. And I had to make some mistakes. And I still make mistakes. And I have to love myself every day. At the end of the day, the most important thing you can do for yourself is to look at yourself in the mirror, look deep in your eyes and say, I love you. In fact, I want you to do it right now. I want you to look in the mirror over your camera, just like I am, and say, Self, I love you. Don't it feel good to say, I love you, to yourself? And that's the first place you gotta start. Then we're gonna talk about eating right and making changes, and how that's gonna lead to changing the people you're with, that's gonna lead to the circle, the experiences, the opportunities, and how you live your life. Yes, the things you get to do. But before you do all that, you gotta love yourself. You can't walk amongst all these lost, empty souls and zombies and think you'll come out unscathed unless you inoculate yourself with love. And that's what I'm gonna give you today. Love yourself first. That's what it's all about. And then use the LLTFF4 core plus one more or whatever else you like to do to get your blood going in your, your mind, loving yourself and that mind body connection and just. Woo, letting it all go. Because every day if you don't let it go, it's going to take you to a place you've never been. And that's the power of surviving life at any age, but especially over 40. I'm closer to 50 than the other side. <laughs> that's for sure. And I'm going to tell you the challenges at this side of, of this age 
are deep and real. And if you haven't experienced it yet, I need you to build that foundation today of self-love. Because when the ghosts come out, when the closet opens, when the casket goes, you want to have an answer for all these questions. And if you don't, I'm going to tell you, you're going to suffer. So right now, get your body right, get your mind right, love yourself, just drink yourself good, take yourself out. In fact, tomorrow, go outside, take yourself out for a walk, date yourself. That's how you love yourself again. See yourself as an entity of joy, not as a beacon of destruction. See yourself as a light, not as a ember. See yourself as something more than what you have been. It's actually what you can be. And that's the power of LLTFF. So I'm the well of the fifth. Please, if you know somebody that needs this, tell them to subscribe. Send them my channel. Send them my website. Tell them that LLTFF is here for you and our community is here to help you be the best you can be. Because at the end of the day, life is short, so let's make every day great. I'm the well of the fifth booty. I will see you on the other side, but until I see you, let's make sure I see you in the streets so we can work out, feel good, and live this best life ever. And next episode, let's talk about Hollywood. I'm going to tell you how that, well, how that's been going. It's an interesting journey, and guess what? It's getting more exciting every day. I'm the one in the fifth foodie. I appreciate your time, and I want you to use these tools to find your path in life. This is what it's all about. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Toad out of dogs, we gonna make it out. Make it out. I would never fall, you can't take me out. I'm popping like a zig, I'm breaking out. And I am hella lit, you want a couch. Yes. They said I wasn't good enough, but this- I'm gonna show you how to get a new life. Hey, who don't want a new life? Thank you so much for your time and your love. I appreciate your trust. I'm the well on the fifth booty. I'll see you soon. Have a great day. People thought that I was done and was looking for a fort. I was coming up short, but I never did a fort. Now I'm popping like a cork. I'm champagne sipping, cause now we got them clicking. I remember days when people wouldn't listen. I was contemplating quitting, but now I'm dripping like a gutter. You know that's what we came from. Yeah, I took a couple L's, now the only ones I take is when I face some. And I just got a new deal like I'm Taysom. You think it's scary now? Wait until the tape comes. Told all the dogs, we gon' make it out. I would never fall, you can't take me out. I'm popping like a zig, I'm breaking out, and I am hella lit.